Hello students, welcome students. Dear students, in our HCFL LCM chapter, today we are going to solve last practice set. That is practice set number 25. Okay. In practice set number 25, we are going to solve the examples of LCM. Lowest common multiple. Comparatively HCF, this is little bit easier. Okay. Let's see. The first question is find the LCM. Okay. While finding LCM, we have to write the multiples. I already explained in a previous video the difference between multiples and factor. Okay. So here we have to find the multiples. Multiples means in short we have to write the tables. Okay. For example, now three. First we will write the multiples of three. Multiples of three. Fifteen. Okay. Uh, if we need more, then we will uh, write more also. Okay. So up to 33, it's okay. These are the mind. Why I give a dot? Means that uh, multiples are going on and on and on. So we will stop here now. We will write the multiples of A. Multiples of A. Uh, up to 48, we will stop now and write the multiples of 12. Maybe students in your mind sir, here you stop for up to 40, here 36, why? Students, if you are in good in tables, your tables are learned properly, then orally you can find the uh, LCM. See here, if you see, LCM means lowest common multiple. In SCF, highest common factor. Here, lowest means lowest common multiple we have to find. Okay. So, common multiple lowest. Lowest means smallest. Now, here 3, 6, 10, 12, if you see there, and here only 24. Here 24 and 24. That's why I now write more factor because already here we got the answer. Okay, if that's why I'm telling you students learn the tables or and write everyday tables. Tables are must in maths. So 24, 24, 24. So here <coughs> then we can get more uh, multiples also. Okay, common. But we have to find lowest. Lowest means which is simple, which is come first in between the given numbers which uh, you got first that is the lowest okay you will get if you uh, write the tables multiples of 3 8 and 12 also to write more then you will get more multiples but we want lowest so lowest is here if you see 24 so you have to write therefore lcm of 3 8 and 12 is equal to 24 this way you have to solve. This is very simple students here. Um, directly we have to write the tables. But those who are, who are good in tables, they, they, uh, they feel this very easy. But those who are not good in tables, write the tables, do the calculation, waste the time. Because max when exam is there, time is very much. So you have to use the tricks. Tricks. If you know the tables, then you can find. Means you can save your time Okay, in exam. So, again I am telling you students, write the tables, learn the tables every day. Now 9 and 12. Okay. So first of all, here three, uh, three numbers are there, here two. So, multiples of 9. Then multiples of 12. 
okay so here students multiples of 9 if you see here hmm, here 72 it's come first means it is a lowest common multiple therefore we have to write therefore LCM of 9 and 12 is equal to 72 simple okay so when you are solving practice set number 24 in your notebook students you have to write these two examples also and then the given examples there are five examples are given in practice set number 25 okay now so that five and these two also example these two already solved you have to just copy and that five you have to solve so i hope there should be no problem now we'll move to the word problems there are five word problems okay so now question number two solve the following problems now i read the problem first is on the playground if the children's children are made to stand for drill drill okay either 20 to a row or 25 means for standing for drill that we doing fast now so they have to stand see in row 20 in number or 25 all rows are complete and no child is left out means we have to balance that what is the lowest possible of the children in the school so we have to find the number of children's lowest possible uh, uh, child, number of children in the school okay so simple thing whatever the given things that you have to write first so here the lowest possible number that we have to find of the children in the school that means we have to find the multiples of 20 and multiples of 25 so here students you have to write this 20 multiples of this calculation you have to do find, find the multiples of 20 find the multiples of 25 then write the same of 20 and 25 and last you have to write in full sentence therefore the lowest number of the children in the school is equal to that and whatever the LCM is here that is our answer okay so this is simple example only you have to write properly that's why I wrote here now the second example Vina had some beads bead moti ki mala she wants to make necklace with an equal number of beads in each necklace she have to make but that number should be means number of beads should be equal if she takes necklace of 16 or 24 or 40 beads if she takes 16 beads or 24 or 40 beads there is no bead left over means if she take that among this 60 24 14 uh, nothing means no bits will be remain okay what is the least common bits with her so what is the least common bits we have to find so what is the what are the given things here uh, the number of bits means so what we have to find now the least number of bits with Vina that is asked in last sentence students what is the least number of bits with her so that's why instead of her write the name the least number of bits with Vina is equal to uh, then we have to find the multiples obviously so multiples of 16 multiples of 24 multiples of 40 so you have to write 16 stable 24 table and 40 stable okay not table students actually you have to write more see here for example with the 30 huh? so i write 33 also okay see you got that's why i'm telling you if you have good in table then you can write whatever we require okay if we got uh, this 24 here only no need to write 27 and 13 33 okay so here you have to write multiples of 16 multiples of 24 and multiples of 21 among these find out the lowest common among these three that's why i choose the here here three numbers here only two so here two numbers example here three so among these three multiples you have to find lowest common multiple and you have to write here therefore the lcm of 16 24 and 40 is equal to the lowest common multiple that you have to write then at last you have to write the answer in full sentence that and this is good habit students always write when word problems are there you have to write the answer in full sentence the least number of bits with winner is equal to 
digest. Maybe you can change your words while writing the sentence. No problem. Okay. So like this way you have to solve. Now we will see the example number 3, 4 and 5. In the third example student. An equal number of ladoos. Wow. Have been placed in three different boxes. So we have to uh, keep the different number of ladoos in three different boxes. The ladoos in the first box were distributed among 20 children. So the whatever the ladoos in the first box that we have to distribute to 20 number of children are 20. So we have to distribute give to 20 children. Then the ladoos in the second box among 24 children. Second box ladoo 24 children so we have to give. And then the third box among 12 children. Okay. Third box whatever the ladoos in that third box that we have to give to number of children that is 12. Not a single ladoo was left over. Condition apply. So, not a single ladu was left over. Okay, otherwise, agal there will be fight. My ladu, my ladu, give me, give me like that. Not like that. Then, what was the minimum number of ladus in the three boxes altogether? So, we have to find the all the number of ladus in the three boxes. So, for that, we have to find the LCM. Okay, now look here. The minimum number of ladus in one box. Okay. First we have to find one box, then we will find the three box ladoos. Okay, quantity of one box ladoo. Now for that we have to find multiples of 40, multiples of 24, multiples of 12. These multiples you have to find, you are good in table. Okay, so you have to find the multiples. Then after that multiples find out the LCM, lowest common multiple of 40, 24 and 12. You have to write that here. And then students the LCM is nothing but the minimum number of ladoos in one box okay so that you have to write here LCM is nothing but the minimum number in one box now we have to find three box so we have to multiply so minimum number of ladoos in three box is equal to three multiplied by the LCM or the minimum ladoos in one box ladoos that you have to multiply whatever the figure is here that you have to write here and multiply then you will get the minimum number of ladoos in three boxes okay i hope you understood this do it that's why i write here calculation simple that it's like this you will do i know now we'll move to the fourth example okay now the fourth example is we observe the traffic signals at three different squares on the same big road traffic signals the uh, they turn green every 60 seconds 120 seconds and 24 seconds okay the timing is given when that turns uh, green when the signal were switch on 8 o'clock in the morning the signal just begins from 8 o'clock in the morning all the lights were green first all the lights are green how long after that will all three signals turns green simultaneously again is after how much uh, times uh, that will be become green okay simultaneously means one after another okay now for that we have to find the LCM now see whatever the given things that we have to write first time for all the three signals turns green that we have to find for that we have to find the multiples of 60 120 and 24 so you have to find you have to find or you have to write here multiples of 60 120 and 24 then you have to write the lcm but whatever the lcm comes that is in seconds so this is a second okay you know and i also know all know that is one minute is equal to 60 second if you want to convert the answer because uh, that is in second then convert into minutes otherwise that will be in second okay 1 minute is equal to 60 seconds, I have got here, therefore the signals will be turned green again after digest seconds or just convert the seconds, for example 120, then 2 minutes, okay, like that you have to write here, or in minutes, write in second or minutes, that is your wish, no, right here, okay, compulsory, so in second also and minute also, now the this one last one is little bit uh, different example okay given the fraction 13 upon 45 
and 22 upon 75. Write their equivalent fractions. You know, while making equivalent fractions, we have to make the denominators same. Okay. What are the equivalent fractions with the same denominators and add the fractions? Means first we have to make the denominators same of these given fractions and then we have to add the fractions after denominator same then only we have to add now okay so then we have to add that fraction so for that first we have to find here the denominators are given 45 and 75 so we have to find here the LCM of 45 and 75 okay that uh, number that means the LCM uh, we got from 45 and 75 is the common denominator there means same denominator let's see for equivalent fractions with same denominators we have to find the multiples okay and multiples of 45 I this example I saw student little bit hard that's why so multiples of 45 45 90 135 180 225 270 and so on then multiples of 75 75 150 225 so here we got our LCM that is 225. So 225 LCM of 45 and 75. So this is our uh, this one common denominator of uh, the first fraction 13 upon 45 and 22 upon 75. So for that what we have to do 13 upon 45. Okay. So we got the LCM. LCM is our denominator. So now. Which, by which number we multiply 45 then we get 225 by 5 okay we got that LCM but we have to write in this form okay so uh, and the rule you know students when we multiply a number to the denominator we have to multiply by numerator by same number so we multiply 5 here we also multiply 5 here so to the numerator so 13 5 is a 65 so we got first fraction equivalent fraction 13 45 equivalent fraction is 65 upon 225 that is equivalent fraction okay now the second equivalent fraction will write 22 upon 75 we know the denominator is same we got 225 so by which number we multiply 75 then we get uh, the denominator 225 3 so we multiply 3 to the denominator according to rule we have to multiply numerator also by 3 so 22 multiplied by 3 that is 66 75 multiplied by 3 that is 200 and 25. So now uh, the equivalent fraction of 22 upon 75 is equal to 66 upon 225. These are the equivalent fraction. So according to our example, equivalent fraction we found, we got now. Now they said add, add that equivalent fraction. So equivalent fractions are therefore the equivalent fractions 13 upon 45 that we already converted. These are the equivalent fractions and addition. Okay, and addition of the fractions. Here students, 65. Actually, this is a, these are the equivalent fractions of 65. Why we add this? Because 35, 30 upon 45. Here, denominator 45, 75. So we uh, make the equivalent fraction of this. So denominators are same. That's why uh, you know the rule. When the uh, when denominator are same, then only we can add. Otherwise, we have to make the denominator same. That we learn already. Okay. So that's why here students. We add 65 upon 225 plus 66 upon 225. These are the equivalent fraction of these two fractions. Okay. Now, so addition of this 131 upon 225. So we solve the example. Whatever they ask, first they ask write the equivalent fractions of these numbers. So 30, 13 upon 45 equivalent fraction is 65 upon 25, and the equivalent fraction of 22 upon 75 is equal to 66 upon 225. After that they ask add that. So the addition, addition of the fractions 13 upon 45 and 22 upon 75 is equal to 131 upon 225. Actually these are the equivalent fractions addition but these are equivalent fractions that's why I write here. Okay. Or here you can write is equal to again 66 this you can write here this step also. If you don't understood then. Okay. I hope you understood students. Uh, so now. For the first term, our syllabus is over. So, for the first term, you have to do study from the first chapter 
to the nine chapter. Total nine chapters are there. Means basic concept in geometry and ECF and LCM. Okay. Now students complete your notebook. Solve all examples. You have any doubt? Okay. So whatever that doubt, write on one page. Write your name and send me on my WhatsApp number. Okay. But students complete your notebook honestly. Don't take help from means don't copy it. Actually help can help from your parents also. But don't copy from the other digest and all that books. Okay. This is math subjects. You have to use your and any doubt students you have to take a photo and send me on my WhatsApp number. I'm ready for solving your queries. Okay student. So I'm telling you again up to nine chapter. This is the syllabus or the portion for our first time exam. So be ready. Do the study. And maths is the subject to make a practice. Solve the examples again. You can change the numbers also, students. Now, from the next week, I will start the trial test also. The trial test, I will give the different types of examples that you have to solve. Okay, so uh, that will help for your exam also. So take care, be happy. Bye, bye, students.